Well, I think this is it, guys. Our final battle. Our final battle with Malos and the ending of Zelda Chronicles 2 should be at the top. Well, not there. Yeah, there. At the top of that ramp. After those doors. Yeah, that's what it marks us. We're going to click one small switch, probably, and finish the battle. Everything we've been through. It comes down to this final battle. And that final heart-to-heart -heart was really sweet between everybody. There, let's hit, hit the control panel. I, I, if you open this door, there will be no turning back. Falling in battle here, meaning restart from the title screen. Your game will be saved before the final battle begins. Okay, then, the game save. You know, I'm paranoid, so I'm going to save. I'll save. And I do this always in threes. <sighs> okay, then, let's do it. Final battle. Let's do this. Oh my god, the final battle is here. Malos. Just in time for the final act, boy. I've saved you the best seats in the house. <laughs> I sounded just like Akos for a moment there. Don't speak. Akos is dead, you bastard. Yeah. So is Petroka. And Jen. Figured as much. Is that all? What? You want me to weep and deliver a eulogy? What good would that do? They all desired oblivion, and now they've achieved it. Least I can do is send them off with a smile. Malos, is this really what you want? Huh? Is this what you want? Malos? I don't understand the question. You must understand by now that none of this is your own will. <laughs> you have to see all of this came from a Malthus. Even if that's true, so what? And don't give me some weak-ass crap about how I should repent or whatever. Why don't you want to hear the truth? Here's the thing. I don't give a rat's ass what you think, rat! So blades become titans, and titans give life to humans. Honestly, who even gives a damn? They can become whatever they want. But that man, he'd lost everything. Jin? Yeah, he's talking about Jin and not the architect. I thought for a moment he might be talking about the architect. He no longer wanted anything. He didn't even want to live anymore. And despite that, his life was the one thing he hadn't lost. Because he couldn't! Actually, that's what he chose. She was gonna die and he didn't allow her. The thought of you forgetting me, it's like one heart is being ripped in two. Words can be a curse. That curse was what kept him tied down here. A wretched tale, isn't it? This whole world is a wretched place. Do not forget that you too are a part of that world. If it were not for you, for Amalthus, both Jin and Laura's lives may have taken quite different paths. Exactly. That's exactly it. You've gotten smarter with age, huh? I'm a wretched being too. A hideous monster, far beyond saving! So... Let's end this now. Here comes Don't you feel the anything? final form of any, Father Savage, every boss. The world he longed for. How could I? That isn't... my role in this world. This man... Does he mean to... The final boss is gonna be a Metcon. That's cool, actually. Ka 
come at me, kid! Come, my partner! Give me all you've got. You better show me all of it! The extent of your will! Show me why you're here in this world! Jesus Christ, Malice went insane. I mean, I get it. He was the blade of uh, Malthus, and Malthus was pretty fucking crazy too. Oh, this reminds me of a, of the battle in the original. Oh, he's only level 70. Okay, so he's not much higher level than we are. Oh no, he's weak to dark, not weak to light. Which is a shame, or he would... Come on. Let's try and see if I can this do this the fastest I can. Yeah, Aegeon, thank you for being here, buddy. And they're away. Does that mean we can fight from far away? That would be cool. Not having to get too close and personal. Do another one of these. Uh, I think we shouldn't keep our diff distance. Let me bring in Nia just so that we can heal. Of course, just as I bring in Nia to heal, he nullifies healing. That would be something that he would do, wouldn't it? God damn it. I enacted boy again to forgot to turn off my notifications. That was a good combo, I think. Damn it! Just as I was gonna change to Mithra to bring in the troop out of the Aegis, he blocks us. Oh no, I need Nia, I need Nia, I need Nia, I need Nia. Okay, good. The debuff ended just when I need it. Which is great. Does it work? With, is it, I think it's with Pyro. I'm gonna try that move. Let's try and get... I don't want healings right now. When I hold on to my power... Come on. Yeah, there it is. Okay, let's say, did we activate something? I think we did. Do it like this, and then do that, and do that, and do that. Let's see how much damage we do. I get it, this is not something they want to do too much, but like, the final boss should just be uh, a battle with... Uh, or... Um, but like, um, we should be the, the, the third Aegis. Oh no, he's, he's barring friends, of course he did. That's what... Uh, Zen that the final boss did before, so why wouldn't he now? Wait, what's happening? Oh, we got we got we got halfway there, I guess. Something's about to trigger something else.
My lady! Domark! Zumak! Don't trouble yourself. It's... nothing. There you go, Tora. Can you still not see? Stop the artifice, Malos. See what, brat? The world's never gonna change if that's all you got. He has balls, I'm gonna say that. The kid has balls in the middle of the fight. I guess the king too, does too. Fight has very safe lives. Oh, so he's the queen, so I guess all the royals are ready to battle. That's nice. Yeah, this really reminds me of a battle in the Mechanic. It will change. Even the way it's going. I will change it. That's the reason we've come all this way. Why don't you just let it go? Who do you think you're doing this for? I'm doing it for myself. If it helps put smiles on people's faces, helps them live their lives together, then that's my role in this world! There you go, Rex. Jin told me to take care of you. In his place, you know. Jin never wanted to die. He just wanted to connect with you. He did it. Because you showed him a path! And how many people died because of it? You'd forgive him just like that? Forgiving isn't that easy, but that's just... Wait, where's this order? The world we live in. We need to find a way forward within that world. <sighs> Even you... used to think like that once! Yeah, how about you fight us like a man, Mr. Oh no. God damn it, Shulk. Today, we use our power to fell a god and then seize our destiny. Oh, dude, no, stop. This is a oh. god. Hurry. The time. Is nigh. Oh my god, the fact that both stories are happening at the same time. And Shulk is a Shulk already has a third Monado in 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 the original game at this point. By what we just hear. Wait, did he have the third Monado or was the battle just beginning again new? Let's see if okay. I can find him from here. No, I have go. to get close, damn it. Show you the end of the world. Wait, when I think I, I can go Pay attention this to through the Aegis the again. Justice. Do I really need to be where do I need to be to fight him? Damn it! He almost killed Zeke! Ooh. Okay, it's just him, but how do we fight him? Okay, he's close again. Okay, just keeps it going. Okay, we just got another combo done, which is good. But my question is... Do I keep activating the Aegis? And how many? Just one? Oh, Jesus. 
Zeke's dead. Great. Where's Zeke? He's all the way back there. Can we hit him from here? Oh, we can. Okay, so I don't need to go up close. I'm dead. Great. Fantastic. But at least I'm close to everybody. I need Nia. Damn it! Everyone's getting sight. We seem to be doing just fine. Maybe we'll get out of this alive. I don't have the strength. Where's Where's Zeke? Where's Zeke? Stop slacking off, Zeke. Much of Nia. Don't give me the order. You'll never succeed. Okay, we're actually make, managing somehow. We're actually managing somehow to do the thing. Ah, damn it, I thought I could get it. Damn it, he had to do it. Okay, I thought maybe we could include... But it seems like it's just with Pyra, not with Mithra. Let's do this. This is actually going well. I mean, there was a period there we actually had a few issues, but now that I know that I can be in the back fighting, it's much better. Okay, we can bring him in. Where is it? Let's do it like this. Okay, now he's actually vulnerable to all the other things. Topple. We couldn't topple it, actually. Jesus, the frames took a dive, a type, a type, a type, a type there. Let's get this. Come on. When do we get to the dissection? Wait! This should be enough for you. Oh, he's far away. We can't do it. Why not? Indeed. New enemy in the mix. Damn it! He's a coward! He's a coward! He's straight up a coward. And I'm back. Now what? You wanna hide? Let's do it. Let's try and do it. Me first. Let's go with Nia. Magnificent. It's up to you, Morak. As planned. Elemental burst. Zeke, aim true. Yeah. Magnificent. If this is how he wants to play, that's how we will play. Let's finish this. It's up to you, Morag. As planned. Work hard, research hard. Elemental burst. Zeke, aim true. Nim. Let yeah. me take care of it. Magnificent. Let's keep it up. Magnificent. Veil. I'll take this one. Elemental burst. Another burst, which is great. It's up to you, Morag. To me. Magnificent. Zeke, aim true. Pass it away is yeah. clear. Magnificent. Draw the enemy's attention. Let's keep it up. Magnificent. I mean, if he wants to do it like this, we'll do it like this. Oh, I hope. It's up to you, Morag. 
Very well. I won't hold back. I mean, we are actually killing the Colossus there with uh, him, which is great. That was great. Where is awesome also a despicable and cursed being? That's karma. You should quit. Go on. Try yeah. to keep going. Okay, let's kill this guy. Because apparently that's what we have to do now. And now we are back, so welcome back everyone. We are again playing well back to me, you guys are still in the same video. Uh we are fighting Well just fighting oh yeah I need to get away from him. Need to, who is he who is he targeting? Morax. Oh Jesus. Oh nobody died. Good. Redemption. Bring everybody health back up. Okay, so now he's back. Good. So now one thing that I figure out for this battle is that he's not that tough. As a boss, he's not that tough, which is kind of a shame. Um, because you would hope that the final boss was more challenging. Well, he's not that challenging. He's still an interesting boss to battle. He's not difficult, difficult, but he does have some things that are completely ridiculous, like nullifies, heals, although we cancel that debuff pretty quickly. But there's one thing that's very interesting, is that once we get, I believe, two more uh, where he's gonna call in he, the goons, he's gonna call in reinforcements, after we destroy both of them, he's gonna do another one of those Siren Breakers. Which I believe by now can counter by just having a good... Um, everybody, like, in good health. Mostly because everybody's actually healed in a way and stronger yeah that's the one thing that changed between episodes is that my team is a little bit stronger than they were previously previously they were not this strong they were a little bit weaker um so that's uh, the thing outside of that that there's not um, weaker they, they were weaker last time they're stronger like we great gain a couple levels one of the levels actually happened during this boss battle funnily enough let's do me and bring me up again use this this time we're going to use Aegeon, but this time we're going to bring in Mithra, or Pyra, I should say. Because now, we do have the advantage on this. Because we now have, we can have to level 4, which is the two things we need. We need either or. We either need a level 4 to, while well, the Siren is an actually easy way to get rid of him. Okay, I have need actually Veil, because it's much better to do this, because he's weak to poison right now. But there's going to be two moves, the Siren Buster, I believe that's the move he does that will do massive damage and kill one of our, our members at that point. And another one that is Prometheus. Prometheus is a bastard of a move, because it's, as far as I know, a one hit, a one -hit shot. It kills you instantly. So it's an actual difficult move to fight through. So all I have to do now is keep him at bay. And then all I have to do is break. Because I have actually gotten pretty close to killing him. The second time I did this boss battle, I actually got somewhat close. And we're doing combos left, right, and center, so we should be close to the first time he's gonna call in uh, his team. That, the other thing that he will do is that he'll go back for the 
Siren Buster. No, no, it's not Siren Buster. It's another move, I think. And I said it is a Siren uh, Buster, and I just didn't realize it. And we still haven't used, as you can see, the true part of the Aegis. Yeah, he's gonna call servants now. Uh, let's see. He called two. All we have to do now is kill this guy. Because the second time he's gonna do this, we can actually heal pretty quickly. If we keep healing and we keep doing damage, and we keep damaging these guys as much as we can, they're not too tough. So we don't need to worry about it too much. I just need those health potions. Oh, I'm toppled, so I'm I'm down. Yeah, I'm dead. Damn it! I was gonna say I need those potions. Just as I say that they're not too difficult. Let me just heal everybody this way. Just as I heal everybody, I can heal everybody again because that's what Nim does. So everybody's back to full health, or close to full health. How did Zeke fall already? Okay, let's bring Pyra in. Let's actually do this already. Because th this one is actually going tougher than the previous one, which is not going to be good. Okay, let's get all of these things, because I don't want to lose anything. The moment we defeat these guys, we're going to have another round of fighting him. I find it funny that he's not doing anything, but he's saying that he's himself he's invincible. Let's just finish this guy off. Okay, he's just gonna launch me. Why? Whoa, 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 whoa. what happened? Ah, damn it, I did the wrong one. I did the wrong one. Bring me in, heal everybody. Ah, oh, damn it, I did it too soon. Where, where, where's Zeke? Okay, let's just heal everybody this way. Oh yeah, now he's weak to Mithra, which is a good thing. And... It's good that we can nullify his debuffs. Everybody's debuffs cancelled. Let's see, come on. I heal everybody as Zeke does this, which is a good thing. Come on. I think we're still gonna have one more stage of the... the of the... Goons coming in. Come on, yeah. If I'm, we have. Come on. Come on. Yeah, we can. I haven't seen it from this side. Oh, they're different. They're different moves. They're not the same move. Done it by. Let's bring Tyra in. Because I have an idea. Come on, Tyra. Come on, Tyra. I have to do it. I have to do it. I needed to do it. 
I needed to do it this way. He's weak to Mithra's power, so let's do it. Okay, he's weak to Pyra, or Mithra, I should say. Come on. I don't want to ruin his weather. Because now, we're actually going to bring the final Aegis. Okay, he's going for the X star. I think that kind of blocked it from doing too much damage to us. And I think... Come on, did we do it? You know what? It's time. I think we can beat him this way. I think we can. The problem is... I can only use the Aegis. I should have done it. Oh, we did it. We did it. Look at the damage she did. That's without breaking anything. And that's a little mental burst. I think... Oh, no. Did I do it too soon? I did it the wrong one. First things first. Yeah, I don't think his HP is going down. And another one. Magnificent. Game. About to say. Begin. Yeah, we did it. We beat the boss. We beat... At the very least, the artifice. Uh... research hard. We got another elemental burst, that's all it counts. Seek, aim true. Uh, first of all. Not a burst. I was about to say, it's a burst. And we actually did it. A full burst. Is it... This is actually it. Did we actually beat the final boss? Did I beat the game? Everybody gotta level up. XP 999, 999, 999, 999. I think I did it. I think this is it. Actually, kind of a weak final boss. Then the original wasn't that much better. Let's finish this. At the same time, Shulk is. Hopefully, we do we do it before Shulk. Wait. Okay, it's the siren giving us power. I thought for a moment that he was screwing us. What's happening? Yeah! Let's get this done. Do so it. So we can move on for the future. Don't waste time talking. You are on borrowed time. Just finish it off. Yes! Okay, it's done. We did it. At the very least, the artifice is gone. The question is, did we beat Malos as well? Because this is reminding me very much of a boss battle in the original game that wasn't in fact the final boss. And we actually beat him up. But is he dying? Is he dead? And that is, Shulk killed Zanza. Shulk did it, and so did we. The Conduit and the Architect are gone now. What's he doing? The Titan. He's ordering the Titans to do and the World Tree. What's gonna what's gonna happen? This is the last gift I can offer you. Oh thank you. 
architect, the rest Bob. Is up to you, my children. Oh, did he, like, give the Titans longer life? Or did he just stop the war? The bots are all done. I think we're going to go in for the final cutscenes. Oh, wow. I hope we are. I don't want to fight Malice again. Yeah, we damaged his core crystal. He's done. Did we kill him or he's just returning to his core crystal? It's been fun, kid. Malos. If only I'd met you sooner. <laughs> just think of the worlds I might have seen. But even so. If, if I had been your driver, all of this... <laughs> Kids say the damnedest things. There was only one driver for me. All... In all, it wasn't... so bad. See, you see, that's the thing that the Noble Chronicles games make you. A apart from X, and even X is an untold, uh, unfinished story, the villains always have a great backstory as to why they're villains. And many times it's not because of like my evilness. Looks like he's finally found it. Like even Malos is not evil because he's evil. A meaning to his life. Indeed. He was corrupted by Amalthus, and Amalthus was corrupted by the stupidity of mankind. Even After Klaus and Zenza. Go their whole lives without finding theirs. Now that I think about it, the architect, <laughs> Klaus is kinda like Piccolo. I wonder... If I'll find mine. You've got one already, haven't you? And if what you've got isn't enough for you, well, you can always leave things to the next generation. <laughs> you've got a point. Surprisingly enough. So what now? It's crazy to think that this was the thing that generated the Bionis and the Makanis. I don't know I keep talking back about, about uh, bringing, the, bringing it back to the original, but it ha you have to. You know, because this is all connected. This is happening at the same time as the original. And the station is just breaking yeah! apart. Are we going to have an escape scene? A la huh? Ocarina of Time, a la What's Super going on? Metroid. And that was the original Metroid. And there might be others, but I don't know. Th that's... What? What's happened? At this rate... All of Elysium will collapse. What? Since the conduit disappeared, the power holding Elysium together was cut off. What's gonna happen when it crumbles? Not everything above this point will either orbit the planet or be flung into space by centrifugal force. However, everything below this point, the world tree itself, will fall apart on top of all rest. No, that can't. The impact would destroy. There, there has to be a way to stop it. Mithra, please. <sighs> Mithra! There is one way. Just one way to prevent it. Five stories down from here, there's a control room for the correction boosters. If we can fire the booster jets and accelerate the whole world tree beyond escape velocity... Look, I haven't got a clue about boosters or velocities, but I'm gathering that we got to get there, and fast.
Okay. Five floors down. Let's hurry. Azurda. Poppy. Hmm? Why do they do this? What did you say? P Poppy could not possibly. Please. You're the only ones I can ask. She's going to sacrifice Poppy. herself, isn't he? Isn't she? You promised. Didn't you? That pillow belt. Please. Piece of work. She wants to take everybody else outside of the station just in case. Is that it? I forget the promise, and, and it was like just two chapters before this one. I like the fact that nobody realized that. Uh, she called Poppy and Azorda, and that they're missing. Guarantee Azorda's gonna show up in this Titan form, take them off all the planet, and... What is this? Oh, that's why, that's the, the objective for Poppy, to Ships. keep him from coming back. Is this a... port? She lied. <gasps> Mithra, what are you doing there? Where's the control room? Mithra! You can't mean... I'm sorry. This was the first lie I ever told you. Mithra! The only way to stop the World Tree's collapse is to use the last of Ion's power and annihilate the World Tree. I'm sorry, it is the only way. You all need to use one of those escape vessels and get as far away as possible. What? The last of Ion's... Mithra, what are you doing? It'll, it'll be fine, right? You'll deal with the World Tree, then come back, right? Wait! Just wait, I'll come with you! Damn it! There's not enough wire! I got it! Poppy? Poppy? It's not okay. Huh. Poppy cannot. What do you mean you can't? Poppy made promise. Mithra say that Rex for sure ask Poppy. Say not help Rex, no matter what. What kind of promise is that? Please, I'm begging you. All you gotta do is take me over there. The rest of you can just... Rex. Come on, please, she's right there. <laughs> Rex. Gramps. Sometimes 
A man must know when to let go. That's Why? depressing. Why? Do it for her, Rex. Do as she asks. Grumps! Chum, how long are you planning on being a baby? She's the girl you love. You've got to accept her decision. That's what being an adult means. This took a turn. Rex. I am so thankful that I've met all of you. Oh, stop it. You're making me feel things. I don't want to feel anything. Stop it. Jesus. Very sad. Jesus, the original was not this sad. Although the original was pretty sad in some instances, it was bound to happen. This is this game hasn't really had that many sad game moments. Games. I mean, an idiot sometimes. Mithra! Oh, don't, don't do it like that. The core crystal. You'll be fine without me now. Mitra. You know, the ending is good and all, good, good and all, but uh, the guy that they vo made a voice act, voice act Rex, sometimes he just is not up to par. That was a terrible line read. You could have done better. I'm not saying I would. I probably wouldn't, but I'm not a voice actor. It's it's, it's in very small instances that this game's voice acting to me just kills it. It, it, it not kills it in a good way like kills the mood and that was that one was an example i mean jesus christ hello there i hope you'll help me together was short a fraction of my long long years but it's been warmer and brighter than any time I can remember before. where did he get that sword you shone a light on my melancholy path you showed me the way
gift of light. Stop the game, please. You're making me feel feelings. I don't like to feel so feelings. So tell me, how was it being alive? Do you really want to know? Well. Well. Did Malos not remember? Or was that just the voice of the Aeon? Or maybe it was the third one, the one that disappeared that I thought was Alvin. Meta! And there it is again, the voice acting. The guy the guy cannot scream. The guy cannot scream to save his life. I'm sorry. I don't want to, to rail on the guy, especially now at the end of the game, but you know. Oh boy. Oh, that's wonderful. How? So, all of that, all of that was worthless. So everything that Mithra did at the end was worthless because we're all gonna die. Or maybe not. This is what she did. Runs. This is what she bestowed upon um, Azorda. Made sense. You know, I think this form does suit me best. Grumps. I didn't even notice his voice was different. Everybody grab onto something. Oh, I don't really remember his voice being like this in the beginning of the game. Well, Zerda, you might find it to be the best, but uh, I like it better when you were small. Whoa, wait, wait. Titans are gone. What happened? I can't believe oh, it. A little trippy what's happening there to, I believe, Zerda's body? Is everyone dead we were too late at the land of Martha okay what was the architect's final gift then if everything's dead oh it's so a little weird of nothing left the, of the, the hair of the of Azorda I mean they're all saying like everything's dead but we're not seeing the Titans we're crossing that rift. We're still seeing Morph, but we don't know what the what, where the Titans are. Well, the Titans were close to Morph, now that I think about it. And everybody's shocked. Okay. Wait. 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 Okay, it's, it's the Titans. They're all here. Are they dying? I don't think so. I think they're just landing back to the sea. Yeah, because they were all flying, technically speaking, through the water. Right, because that's where... Wait, where? I don't know. Yeah, they're swimming. I don't want to say what I think this is because I've said so many things in this game that have turned out to be wrong, especially during this ending. Oh, the Titans are just crashing. If this is what I think it is... So wait, no more Titans. Is that what's happening? Oh my, this seems like I can't say. The Titans. They're joining with the land. Okay, there comes a uh, big boy, Morardain. And it's raining. Wait a minute. That's true. So his order was always different. I, think I see what Klaus meant by 
restoring the world. Oh, so the Titans, when they were dying, they were coming back to the Earth to join it. Oh, that's a cool concept. That's a cool idea. And okay, so it's not what I was thinking. For a moment, I thought this was... What, what he did with that circle was combining the Rumps. world somehow. Of the, the, the Rebel Chronicles 1 and this. So Elysium was... here all along. You know, Rex, I think you're all right. That's what I was gonna say, like, wait, what's those things? Oh, new blades! I thought he was combining the worlds and when we saw the mass, the, 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 the land, and just endlessly, I immediately thought, yeah, this is the ending of Xenoblade Chronicles 1 in the original. Spoilers, when you beat the final boss, when you beat Zenza, and we had that little thing of like fighting Klaus, um, where the, the Bionis, which was the last, Finally oh, those are not blades, those are the, the, the fragments of the, the debris from the space station. What am I thinking? Um, the Bionis crumbles because the world no longer has a god which Shulk then renounces to of being um, then we had that little thing oh it's over okay I think there's gonna be post credit scene because I might have been spoiled about the post credit scene and unless it was just fan art I'm glad uh, and I, I've, no, I've been spoiled by one of the comments in my video regarding the Xenoblade Torna DLC. But anyway, uh, what, what was I? What I was asking? Oh yeah, the ending of the Xenoblade Chronicles 1, you beat the final boss, you beat Klaus, let's put it that way, you beat Zanza. And the Bionis crumbles, Alvis, or the Manado, tells you the world needs a new god, Shulk doesn't want, want to be the god, Shulk wants a world with no need for them. And... The Bionis still crumbles, but then the Earth, where the Bionis and the Maconis fell, are now the places where people live. And I believe we're living with what used to be, or the final, the ending sequence of the game is where the Bionis used to be. Because the Maconis, technically speaking, was completely destroyed by Zanza. I do think the arm is still, yeah, the arm of the, of the Maconis is still there, but everything else about the Maconis was destroyed by Zanza. So that's what I thought it originally. I thought that the architect in his final grasp was going to combine the worlds, as in like... But then that would have not made any sense because at the ending... Well, then again, we have been seeing more things about 2 than... About the ending of 1 than we in 2 than we did in 1. But still, the ending of... That would have made it impossible because of the ending of 2, of 1. Uh, we are already in the Bionis in the world with no Titans and this hap- Oh, then again, it could have been just the time. Ah, it's weird because we don't know how time works in the two worlds. But yeah, th about this game. Very good game. It's my third favorite Switch game as of right now. Uh, Smash Ultimate probably will surpass it when it comes out. And we have to see how the DLC goes. Uh, in terms of Xenoblade Chronicles games in general, it's funnily enough my second favorite. But then again, the original Xenoblade Chronicles is my second favorite game of all time. Uh, but when it comes to... I'm going to divide it into three things. Like, the original obviously wins, in my opinion, because it was the best. Um, when it comes to story, I prefer the story, uh, the story of one. Well, this was good. This was not as good as the original. The original, in, especially the second half of the game, is full of twists and turns. Uh, the battles with Egil. Uh, which the final boss here reminded me a lot in the final battle with Egil before we find everything. The betrayals, uh, the villains in the first one. Uh, also, the, uh, this one also shares a lot of the, the complexity as a villain. I will say the one thing, this game does the villains better in my opinion. Here, no, here's the thing, this game makes the villains basically the Mechon. You know, everybody on the Mechonist that, that was on the evil side had the reason to be evil, you know. Uh, and this happens a lot in this game. All the villains had a reason to be villains or against us. And but when it comes to characters, Shulk versus Rex, I prefer Shulk. Shulk had a better story. That was a tragic moment. Ooh, truly, one of the only moments in this game that was actually comparable to the moments of the game of the original. That was the death of Van Dam. I'm trying to think of other moments in in this game that compare to the original. 
I can't really think of it. Uh, the, this one was obviously more about the relationship between Rex with Pyra and Mithra, while the original one was also more about Shulk and Fiora and later on Melia. Uh, deaths, there was only one death that was actually kind of sad in this game, that was Van Damme, which it made it better because Van Damme did not return. Um, interestingly enough, the, the Manado had three forms, so the, 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 the Aegis with Pyra, Mithra and then Numa, uh, the Manado only had three forms and all of them were just Form 1, Form 2 and the true Manado. Actually, technically speaking, there were three Manados, just like this game had three computing systems. Um, but like the, the ref like the true power of the Aegis came too soon. Um, Malos as the main villain, and uh, uh, Malthus as like a stepping stone to the main villain, felt a little bit forced in my opinion. Not that he wasn't a good villain. I think he did his job well, and his final form was crazy. But I feel like in their need to to having like two sides and to show everything's not black and white, which did a good job in this game. They kind of went with uh, not as good as the original, and I, I know I'm, I keep saying that, but the original, you know, you think that the Bion the Maconis is all evil, and then we learn everything about the, about the, uh, the Bionis, and it makes sense why Egyo wants revenge so much. And I think we're getting to the end of, uh, of the credits because we're getting to the final scenes of the game. But in terms of story, again, the original was better because of the, the, the second half of that game, the story is brilliant. After Prism Island, the game becomes completely different than what you were expecting. In terms of gameplay, this game wins, I'll say that. The gameplay was better because of, you know, the timing and combining of the art was great. Uh, in terms of graphics, I think it's unfair to compare the two, but if I had to give it to one, I would say to the original, because it did less with more, or did more with less, and when it comes to in terms of Xenoblade Chronicles games, of which ones are my favorites, I'll say in, in order will be the original, 2, and then X. X does a lot of good things, but in terms of gameplay, it doesn't beat the other two. In terms of story, it's an unfinished story, so it doesn't beat the other two. And in terms of gameplay, it, I feel like it's the weakest, you know? But still, great game, terrific game, I, I'll say. My third favorite on the Switch, behind Odyssey and obviously Breath of the Wild. And I think this is what I've been spoiled, you know? Which, I'm not gonna say it until it actually shows up. Or it happens, if it does happen. Also this song, not as good as Beyond the Sky. Also, in, in general, seeing this moment for what I think it is, not as good as the final moments as the original. And I'm sorry that I keep bringing up the original, but the original was so good! I want the remake of the original on the Switch, with the gameplay of this one, funnily enough. And yeah, now they're separated. This was what I, what I was spoiled. Pyra and Mithra are now separated, and they're, they're two girls. Which makes no sense that they're, uh, they're, they're divided now. That's a cute, that's cute. Yeah, I figure as much it will be near to push him. Go, come on dude, just go. Nia ends up in this game being the Melia of the team. Except she's in the, with the team longer. You know, I kind of want to know what they said there. But at the same time, it's cool that we don't know. Final chapter, and thus boy met girl. Yeah, and everything, every chapter always has that.
Oh, so the, the image that I saw was not the final image. Because the image that I was spoiled was Shulk or Shulk. Greg's holding both of their hands. I'll say this, in terms of plot device, Aegis versus the Monado, Monado wins. The Aegis had a personality, but, you know, they don't compare to... Well, the Monado also had personalities. There were three Monados, technically speaking. Yeah, the Trinity was also better villains. Yeah. As you can see, a day later than what I did originally. So yeah, that was it. This recording session took about one hour, but I, then I was finishing up. Oh, that's the final thing that I see, that, I've, that I had seen. But anyway, this was a terrific game, a terrific adventure. Cannot wait for next month, because this, is, this, this video is going to go up in August. So next month, we're going to be getting Torna, the Golden Country. And I'll be doing a playthrough of that again. Hopefully doing it faster than I did this one because this took way too long. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. I've been The Legend of the S. And I'll see you guys next time.